Quick, man, I'll be right back, all right? All right, I'll be right back. To bring about a little trust But we shall overcome I believe someday If you'll only listen To what I have to say And how long have you held Your white teacher Who told you you love Your black preacher Can you respect Your brother's woman friend and share with black folks, not of kin. If you had a choice of colors, which one would you choose, my brothers? If there was no day or night, which would you prefer to be right? And if you had a choice, of colors which one would you choose my brothers if there was no day or night Cutie, is your mommy home? Cutie, who is it? Some man. Uh, baby, run in the kitchen and turn off the water for mommy, okay? so good. Don't. Look, I know I fucked up. You left me here alone with her, raising our daughter all by myself. Nobody helped me, Terrence. Not my family and not yours. I'm sorry, but I didn't actually go to jail. You never answer my letters. You wouldn't even let me come visit you. I just thought you two were better off without me. I didn't want you and Tiana to see me like that. You shouldn't have even come here. Look, every day inside I thought about you two. And sometimes the only way to make it on the inside is forget about what you got on the outside. I mean, they were offering me 60 years. 60 fucking years. I didn't want you to put your life on hold for me like that. Well, I would have. 
Look, I know I made some stupid decisions. And if I can go back and change things, I would. But we can't. But we can go forward. Give me a chance to make things different. To be a father. Don't do it for me. Do it for Tiana. I heard all this before, Terrence. Look, I put this on everything I love. Okay. Terrence Davis. Just call me Poncho. Poncho. Hey, Poncho. Can I get you something? A soda? Coke? Water? Juice? Coffee? Anything? No, I'm sorry. Good. Good. Okay, let me see. Uh, my name's Ray Wilkes. I've been assigned as your parole officer. Uh, do you understand this program? I check in to see you every week. If not, I go back to jail. <laughs> okay. <laughs> in a nutshell, very good. Now, my job is to keep in contact with you and just make sure you're upholding the conditions of your release. Now, did they go over this release with you? I think so. Good. Let me go over it again, just in case you didn't remember, all right? You're currently on two years parole. Now, during this time, you're prohibited from consorting with felons. You're unable to carry firearms. You're prohibited from the use of any narcotics, unless, of course, prescribed. Uh, you must maintain gainful employment. This means that you cannot, you cannot be without a job for more than two weeks. Any failure to do so or any failure to comply with any of these will put you in violation of your parole, which, of course, means you'll be returned to the camp. Is that clear? Crystal. Okay, now could you sign that, please? Any progress in final work? No, not yet. Let me see. Uh, huh, anything you will not do? Any job you do not like? I just want something legal instead. All right. Look, I have a friend who works with a lot of my parolees. He's taken care of me in the past. Why don't you give him a call? Here's his card. Okay. All righty. Appreciate this, Good luck. This is your uniform. Why don't you go in the back, change, and come back out here? I'll tell you what you got to do. Okay. All right. See you still got your flower garden going on. Yeah. You know, someday I'm gonna have my own flower shop. I'm gonna name it Keisha's Flower Shop. <laughs> well, let me make the first contribution. <sighs> Baby, you got a job. It's not much, but it's something. Exactly, it's something. Give me some. What are you guys doing? <sighs> Hey, cutie pie. I got something for you, too. Oh, now what do you say, Tioni? Thank you, Daddy. Come on, stop the cop. Stop the motherfucking cop, man. Get the fuck out of here. Stop the goddamn cop, man. Man, the motherfucking bitch don't need to drop out the goddamn money, man. I ain't going back to that motherfucking cop, nigga, man. Damn, man. man. Come on, go back to sleep. 
Hey, David, you're falling behind, man. Pick up your pace. You don't get those orders out in time. We get backups out at the register. Backups out at the register means customers have to wait. And if customers have to wait, then we aren't doing our job now, are we? I guess not, man. Exactly. Now let's see what we can do about that, okay? We close. What's up, man? <laughs> What's up, man? What's up? What's up, man? What's up, boy? Man, this nigga about a couple of motherfucking months. What's up? This nigga What's up? ain't holler that nigga, man. Come on, man. It ain't like that, man. I'm just trying to get shit straight with Keisha and the baby, man. I see. This market suit on, flipping burgers like a motherfucker. Man, it's just a job, man. A job that pays the bills. That's it. Nigga, a job? What they pay you? 450, 475, some bullshit like that? Man, this shit just temporary, man. I'm gonna get something real soon, man. Yeah, temporary can get permanent real soon, nigga. That's what you get. Locked up five motherfucking years, he get all out domesticated and bullshit. Like domesticated? That. Nigga, you can't even spell domesticated. Anyway, I've been locked up four years, 11 months, 29 days, 11 hours, and 23 minutes. Man, that's time yeah. me and my family can't even get back, man. Cool, man. Whatever that shit is. Hey, Davis, bring your ass in here. <laughs> man, look. I'm gonna get back in here, man, and try to bust this nigga ass, man. I see your boss, man, got your hand up. It's cool, though. Every Saturday we be at this club called Club Memphis, man. You need to come down. We need to talk some business. Okay, okay. I'm gonna try to do that, man. All right. All right. I'm cool, man. I'm cool, man. All right, nigga. Here we come, Papa. <laughs> Every day this fucking man's on my dick about something. Baby, you two don't have to be homeboys. Let me just go to work and do your job. I hate this damn job. Come home, smell like fries, onions, milkshakes and shit. <laughs> you smell good to me. Something better is coming, baby. You just have to be patient. I will. Promise? What? Promise. Say Come it. Come on, Keisha. Say it. I promise. What? Nothing. If you have a question to ask, you can ask it. What are you? 25? You can't be more than 25. 28, actually. Shit. Seems like they're making detectives younger every year. How long you walk the beat before you pass for detective? I got a sign. No shit. After college in the academy, I had my choice of divisions. I chose homicide. Well, you got your work cut out for you. This city's considered one of the worst in drug trafficking. And where there's drugs, there's dead bodies, which keeps us employed. So the world's so screwed up and ensures our job security. Till the end of time. Any butterflies? You know, you only get one chance to catch your first case. I'm ready. Well, let's bust that cherry of yours. <laughs> What we have here? One very dead brother. Five gunshot wounds, four to the chest. Name is Tim or something. Recognize it from the neighborhood. Drug related. Holding anything? Found what appears to be 20 ounces on him. So kills him but leaves the drugs. It wasn't about the drugs. Somebody sent a message. Territory beef or something. Look that way. Nine millimeter. Weapon of choice. Close range. Yeah, too close for comfort. Hey, I'm heading back to the house. You want me to book those narcotics for you? Fine by me. It saves me from going to five. You start getting statements from these people here. See if you can dig up an eyewitness. Okay. Yo, Davis. I need to see you in the back now. Okay. Let's go. Okay, Davis. I've had a little problem the past couple of weeks. The uh, register's been coming up consistently short. Sure. What do you mean, sure? Well, our receipts are not matching up to the cash drops at the end of the night. 
And the problem is that this is happening on the shifts that you work. Man, you saying I did this? No, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that maybe this isn't the right job for you. Man, you got 15 other motherfuckers working in there. I've been busting my ass here for three months. And so when I've been to jail, you accusing me of stealing? Man, all this overtime I've been doing? Look, I I my ass, man. You need to get a witness for some motherfucking proof, a videotape or something. I don't want any trouble here, man. Well, you done found you a boatload of it, bitch. You gonna accuse a man of being a thief and you ain't got the balls to stand up to it? Okay, I want you to leave right now. Hey, fuck this shit, man. Hey, fuck I'm calling the fucking shit, cops. Asshole. Come on, finish, Mommy. Can I go watch TV? Yeah, sure. Come on, baby. Just put your plate in the sink first. Baby, you haven't said one word since you got home. I just had a long day. Well, why don't you go lay down? Sleep won't change anything. I can't keep letting you take care of me like this. Baby, do you hear me complaining? No, but... Baby, trust me. If I got fed up, you'd be the first one to know. I just didn't think it was going to be like this. Well, I mean, you just got out. It gets easier, baby. You just got to give it some time. You keep saying that, but... That's because it's the truth. I just feel like I gotta get out of this city sometime. Get away from here. And go where? I don't know, someplace. It's a place like Florida. Florida. Yeah, you know, with the, the beaches, the sunshine, you know, the, the weather. Hurricanes. And hurricanes. <laughs> I mean, you know what I mean. You know, so we can have a new start. You know, like with your flower shop. That's true. Oh, baby, when you ready, I'll be right there with you. You'll do that for me? You'll just pick up and go? Yeah, baby, I believe in you. You see, if we're together, then we're together. I mean, you don't have to do it alone. I mean, right now, I'm carrying the load, but sometime soon you will. But for right now, you need to go in there and wash the dishes and earn your keep. <laughs> Looks like you got a little employment problem here. I'm looking for another job right now. Not good enough, my man. I got fired for no reason. Let's see if that's a pretty damn good reason now, isn't it? He? He's lying. Okay. Let me educate you on how the system works. You are an ex-con. If you don't work, you go right back in the slammer. Look, I know how that system works, right? You call me Mr. Wilkes. Look, I put myself on the line for you and you made me look like a fool. That man was a very, very good friend of mine. And you ruined a very good opportunity. Look, can't you lie something else up for me? That's not gonna work, my man. Why? I do not like you. Because I don't like you. I don't like your type. You walk around like the world owes you something. If it was up to me, you'd be rotting in hell right now. I'd have you right in the cell for the rest of your life. Rot in fucking hell, man. You sure a fucking ex-con. What the? I ain't fucking Hey, man. sit down! I, I just go get a sign to somebody else, man. You sit your ass down! Do you know what stands between you and jail me? One phone call, I'll have your ass in jail so fast your head'll spin. What the fuck is this? It's called grease in the wheel, my man. You take care of me, and I'll take care of you. You're trying to charge me like I'm your bitch. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's a very serious accusation now, isn't it? You telling me if the manager fired me because of you? You could run your game on somebody else, partner. Hey, 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 hey. It's funny how a urine test could come up positive. Or how I can tell him that you missed a couple employment visits. How does that hit your brother, man? So what do you think of that? How does that sound to you, big boy? That's bullshit, man. That's bullshit. Hey, so is life. Who's gonna believe you? I'm an upstanding citizen. People like me, man. Nobody's gonna give a shit about you. How much, man? How much? Now we're talking. What do we say about, uh, about 150 bucks a week? How the fuck am I supposed to come up with 150 dollars a week? Well, that ain't my problem now, is it, boy? You're a smart kid, you figure it out. Get the fuck out of my office, I'm through with you. What the fuck you looking at?
What you doing, girl, with all that? Ooh, none. What's all that poking from the bag? Ooh, none. What you got going over there? Ooh, none. What's all that making stop? Let me see your tongue, man. He's arrested. Wow. <laughs> Cause it looks like the beat. Taking this back, I'm confiscating this. <laughs> you ain't dancing this. Already got me hit the time on the spell. Walking by, looking at the well on that tail. Can't tell you ain't fine with that big old hump. Girlfriend, you got mega junk in there. Waiting on this all night. Pet. Damn, that's stout. Then the coochie hole, let them know I'm about it. Damn, me a ticket, can she kick it? Well, hey, what's up, man? What's up, motherfucker? It's cool, man. This nigga know me. I'm your cousin Draco boy from way back. I know you remember me and shit, man. He's busy, motherfucker. Move on. Man, this shit business, dawg. Business? Yeah. Hey, this is the weekend. My day off. You wanna discuss some business? You gotta call me on Monday. Make a pummel like everybody else. Nigga, I need some work. What? What? Ho hold on, man. Not in here. Not in here. Step outside, motherfucker. Shit ain't even necessary, man. Nigga would've came for beef, that shit would've been happened, dawg. Some beef? <laughs> Whatever, nigga. Look, don't come in my motherfucking place talking about no damn work. I run clubs, you understand? Anybody else say different, they don't know what the fuck they talking about. Man, this shit business. Man, business, only business you got is to get your dick hot off one of these hoes up in here. Now get the fuck away from around here before it get ugly. Fuck Real. them niggas, man. We get our motherfucking dope from somewhere else, man. Fuck them niggas, man. Boys put tones on us, dog. Fuck them, baby. It's cool, man. Fuck them. Man, y'all need to leave that shit alone, man. What's up, nigga? You finally decided to pop up on What's up, man? What's, what's up? What's your V? What's up, baby? Crazy you around now, baby. Yeah, what's up? I see y'all still trying to tear up clubs and shit. Yeah, something like that. You ride with us or what, man? Yeah. All right. Working man like you actually got a day off? Yeah, something like that. What you drinking, man? Just give me a beer. Hey, sweet lips. Ride a beer on your boys, man. Hey, who was that nigga that him y'all up at the club, man? You ain't never heard of Big Pat? Yeah, yeah, I heard that nigga, man. He used to be a rock for rock nigga back in the day, didn't he? Yeah, not no more. That nigga on now. Yeah, man, but suppose Pat moved all the way to town. White, drove, dog food. Man, nigga been shutting down niggas left and right, man. There's only still a few niggas making cheese. Man, you ready to shut them down too any minute now. Spot done got so hot, man, that nigga ain't bullshit. Man, look, we can cut this drug shit show right here, right now, man. That's what I like about you, man. You don't never be bullshit, man. You be straight to the point. Yeah, big business. See, that's what I'm about too, man. You niggas know this shit, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about a for sure opportunity, man, to get paid, dog. All right, I'm listening. See, man, I be fucking on this hoe, man. You know what I'm saying? I got the bitch in the palm of my hand, man. The whole one even blink lines I tell her so, man. She calls herself Lexus. Lexus? Yeah, Pat used to fuck with her back in the day. He don't fuck with her no more, though, man. He just gave a job at this club as a coat check bitch. You know what I'm saying? He paying all kinds of money and shit, man. But he keep it real close cause she know things. You see, Pat lips get loose when he sprung on one of them bras, you know what I'm saying? Tend to talk shit about his paper and his power like he the black trump or some shit. Man, about a month ago, man, me and the bitch got real drunk, man. The whole started telling me about this man whole operation, man. And she mentioned the dope game. So I just played it off, act like you know nothing wasn't going on. Like I wasn't paying attention. She started telling me all kinds of shit, man. Bitch started talking about the main merchandise, his drop-offs, pickups, everything, man. Is that bitch for real? She ain't got no reason to lie. You see, nobody know exactly how much dope this nigga got. Who he fuck with don't talk. Whoever talk ain't gonna talk no more. You hear me clearly? That's what that drama at the club was about, man. I was just trying to make sure, man, everything Les has told me was right about that nigga. All right, and what's this got to do with me? 
Everything and nothing, man. Depends on what you want. Tell me what you want me to know. Man, you think that nigga would've came to me like that, man, if his business was straight, man? Listen, man, it's a chance for us to get paid, man. Get our ass in. Well, look, this a dumbass move, man. You can't rob a nigga like Big Pat, man. That nigga keep his ears to the street, man. Oh, man. This ain't about weight, though, dog. You know what I'm saying? She said at any given time, man, it could be 55, 60,000. Easy. 60,000? It may be more than that. That's why we got to pull this lick, man. That shit to get us straight, baby. You talk all that job shit you want, man. But I ain't cut out for that 9 to 5 shit, man. For real. Look, man, what choice you got, man? You just an ex con to the motherfuckers, man. You act like we got some motherfucking Wall Street gigs or some shit in our future, real, man. man. For real, dog. Look, man, I can't be going to rob somebody, man. I'm on parole and shit. Man, I can't be doing this shit no man, more. Man, who you trying to convince, dog? The simple real, fact dog. you came here and met with us tonight, man. I know you real. with it, with it, man. Yeah, that's why we need you on this. Man, with your brain, I know we can pull this shit off. 55, 60,000, chopped up between us three. Man, we couldn't do no worse. Man, a cool or something, man. Get you and the family started off right, man. Back on the bricks, baby. Can't beat it. This drug money, too, man. He can't even call the police man, on this shit here, man. Thinking, That's man. What you thinking? That's what we talking about, man. Look, man, I don't. Look, look. I don't man. know, man. You ain't gotta tell us now, man. Just decide and call us later, man, when you figure out what you fuck you wanna do, man. Okay, man. I'm gonna think about this shit here, man. I'm gonna right. think about this. Cool. Good as gold, built it up from nothing. But most motherfuckers can't do what I did. You know the problem is with your average motherfucker? That they fail to see the big picture. Most motherfuckers ain't got no vision. All they want to do is ride around town in a clean car, buy up some expensive jewelry, or a big bankroll they can show off to impress some bitch. But that's the show cheese. The show cheese. Yeah. But not me. I believe in long-term investment. The key to long-term investment is you gotta trust in your own abilities, your own instincts. But I bet you as good as dead. How long you been working for me, Ed? Over a year. You like what you do? I got no complaints, man. I make good money. But are you happy, though, dog? I guess, yeah. You guess? What if I told you today I can make you a rich man? What you think, man? I say, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds like a yes to me. Fuck yeah. You see this here, Eddie? That's for you. What I do for all this here, man? Oh, Eddie, I see the potentials in you. The potentials for great things. I'm gonna give you a promotion. I want you to be my right hand nigga. What you think about that? Whatever you say, dog. Hold on, Eddie, hold on. See, this is business, Eddie. You don't just agree to some shit without knowing the terms. All right, man, I'm sorry. I don't apologize, man. Just pay attention. See, I figure since you've been ripping me off anyway, I'm just gonna give it to you all at once. Man, I don't know what you're talking about. That's once, Eddie. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Eddie, that's man. twice. And if you lie to me again, I'm gonna kill you where you fucking stand. Hold up, man. Let me explain. No, I'm gonna explain. See, I figure since you've been dipping in my shit for the past five months, making about $5,000 on the side, give or take a few, equal up to about 25 G's. See, I'm gonna cut out this middle, man, and I'm gonna give you the whole 50,000. Oh, no, Pat, man, I know I fucked up, man. I know I fucked up. Come yeah, on, yeah. I know, you did. Come on, man. Please don't do this to me, man. man but see, today we got an agreement, on, and a deal is a deal. Hell no. Oh, no. See, Ed, I want you to be my right-hand man now. Because I'm taking your left. What you mean you're taking my left, man? What's going on? Hey, what's the deal with that? Oh! Oh, shit! Oh! Oh, shit! Oh! 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 Oh!
the fuck going on, man? You motherfucker, man. What the fuck you done to me, man? Look at me, man. Fuck. See, Eddie, I should let you live. But I got a heart. Smooth. Kill it. Don't tell these motherfuckers. Shoot me. We dance. Oh, no. bitch. We oh. dance. Bitch. Terrence, you could be making the most important decision of your life. The army isn't for everyone, but it could give you the structure and discipline that you need in your life. Have you thought about what you want to do? No, not really. Do you like to travel? I ain't never really been nowhere but Mississippi and Arkansas. This could be just the thing that you need. A chance to see the world, expand your horizons. You married? No, we have a daughter. But we plan on getting married real soon. The military is a strong environment for the family. Medical taken care of, good schools in the towns you'll be stationed. Daycare if necessary. Okay. Sounds good. Look, Terrence, I'm not trying to force you into making any hasty decisions. But if you feel that this is the right thing to do, why wait? I can have your forms processed, an entrance exam, and a physical this week. Okay. All right. Is there a problem? Yeah, it's a it's a section here that says something about criminal past. I was charged with two counts of second degree murder. But I'm innocent. That's a class A felony. The military does not accept anything such as that. It poses a little problem. Yeah. Hey, Juice, what's up? It's me, man. Hey, I'm in. Look, man, I need you to meet me at the wayside at 10 o'clock tonight. No, nah, I can't come at 10. I gotta wait till Keisha goes to sleep. All right, cool. Just come by when you can, man. All right, look, just this one, man, and that's it. All right, nigga, damn. All right, look, we're gonna do this my way with no fucking questions. Man, I wouldn't have it no other way. All right, I'll see. Pancho. What's up? What's up? What's going on, baby boy? Who the fuck is this? It's Chad. Man, get rid of us. Look, hey. either she go or I go. Oh, come on, man. All right. Hold up, man. Hold up, hold up, hold up, man. Calm down. You're too close, man. You can't have it. <laughs> This shit we finna do. Man, look, dog. Have, have a seat, man. Let's explain this shit, man. Let me explain this shit. Damn. Damn. This ain't no fucking game. Y'all may want to go back to jail, but I don't. She cool. She straight, Pete. I promise. She straight. For real. I would've had her if I ain't trust her. What she doing her? Nigga, you ain't got shit to worry about. We need the tones. She got them for the low low. She got some for real shit, man. That's some for real shit a nigga finna get into, man. We need her on this point. Man, I'm telling you, niggas talking shit, but I'm the one with all the shit. You hear me? I got all the shit. Man. Shit. I got Glocks. Nas. Man, and this jump right here. Oozy thing. For sure. Take a nigga out. It's cool if you're going to do Desert Storm, but this an in and out job. A nigga gonna drop it off whether you put a BB gun or a sawed off in his face. But is you sure about that though? Man, you don't know what's gonna happen when we get out on that battlefield. For real though, you don't know that. Look, all right, if y'all wanna hear, y'all pay out y'all cuz. Cause I want my third off top. It's already been worked out. 
See, I told him, I don't need much. Just give me a little something. Pay for the guns. I do this shit for a living. Everybody here to be clear to this shit over with. This ain't gonna hurt nothing. Oh, man. This nigga too serious. Look, from what y'all telling me, it seems like this whole operation is like clockwork. Two sons a month, they all live between two locations. Yeah, let's say they move through the living truck at the meatpacking plant. So it looking like nothing more than a routine meat delivery. That nigga kinda smart. Smart enough, though. You used to work over there at the loading docks, didn't you? About two years. So you kind of know the whole operation in and out, right? Like the top of my nuts. All right. All right, well, DJ, you handling the car. Me, Chad, and Juice, we gonna deal with the exchange. We gonna set up early and move <coughs> in quick. So how many we talking about? I'm thinking no more than about five, six toppers. Anything more than that, niggas gonna start getting nose. Come on, what? What is on? Hey, Chad. Hey, What have you been doing, Terrence? Terrence! What? Where do you go every day when you leave here? To work, where you think? Don't lie to me. Where are these questions coming from? You see, I got this strange call today from your job. Your manager wanted to know, did you want your final check mailed to you, or did you plan on picking it up? You better talk to me, Terrence. That manager been on my ass since day one. He been looking for a reason to get rid of me. I'll find another job. <laughs> It's not about the job, Terrence. I could care less about the job. The point is, you lied. Look, I was gonna find another job. There wasn't even no reason to me bring it up until then. See, you don't even see that you did something wrong, do you? This is just how it happened last time. First, you were keeping little secrets from me, and before long, I didn't know what to believe when you opened your mouth. Next thing I know, you in jail. I, I can't go through this again, Terrence. Look, you turn this shit into something that it ain't really is. You have a daughter who's just getting to know you. I'm not gonna let her get hurt. Like, everywhere I turn around, like the walls are coming in on me. I can't catch a break nowhere. Just give me a chance to, to make it right. It's, it's gonna get better, I promise. Maybe you just better start looking for another place to stay. I mean, I can wait until you find work, and then after that, that's it. I love you, Terrence, but I, I can't go through this anymore. This is just too hard. I, mm -mm. Probably a real smooth operation. They probably ain't never had no problem before. They weren't even expecting it to be us. There it goes, right there. There it goes. Man, who ever think this shit was going down? Shit. Us? Look, man, this I was the fuck up. Yeah, we straight. Alright. Next Sunday we here.
move, y'all move. move. Y'all move. What the fuck, man? Shit. Give me the motherfucking bag, man. Give me the motherfucking bag. What the fuck is this shit? Shut up. Give me the motherfucking bag. Shut Shut up, up, bitch. You don't, you don't Shut up, this. Y'all motherfuckers know who y'all fucking with? Nah, no, nigga, but fuck em. Give me the motherfucking bag. Get down. This is bullshit. Get down. Lay your motherfucking ass down, bitch. Bitch, you better shoot me. Bitch, you better kill me because your ass is dead. No problem. Didn't even get hurt. Shut up, whole idea of trying to mend it. Yeah, yeah, she, she right, she right. Shit didn't go like we wanted to go, but niggas still took it that motherfucking bitch. Man, do though, you man. realize how serious this situation is? At first, it was just about the money. You think the police gonna overlook this shit? What's done is done. Five niggas are dead now. Five fucking niggas are dead now. Should've been sick. Oh my god, somebody got away. Hell yeah, thanks, this punk ass. I told you, we just in and out. In and out. Don't shoot nobody unless you have to. Are you dumb? You just look like that. Man, the nigga was talking shit. He should have shut his motherfucking mouth for real, though. This who you trust, right? This who you trust, right? I told you I didn't want this whole here in the first place. Nigga, you had a clear shot of him and you froze up like a little bitch. Bitch. Bitch, whatever, man, bitch. Man, we can't get, get this bitch to my head on this hole, man. I'm telling you. Get that shit away, man. Get that shit away, dog. Be fucked up, bitch. Bro, is it just me or is this way more than 50,000, baby? Jackpot! Don't play with that. Whoa! Yeah. Don't play with that. Damn. Yeah, what do we have here? A little special delivery? Multiple homicides, sir. Looks like it was a hell of a shootout. What went down? We got one dead body on the truck, four more on the loading docks. Things are getting hot. Seems to be some kind of turf war. Merry Christmas. This guy look familiar to you? Can't say that he does. I'm assuming there was no eyewitnesses. Out here, this is no man's land. But we did get this. What's this say to you? That anyone wearing a mask obviously did some homework. Yeah, a little extracurricular activity, too. These guys were amateurs. Bag that hat, bring it down to the lab. Have them run hair samples on it. Sir, thanks. What do you think? Well, it's four drug related this week. It's gonna get a lot worse before it gets any better. Hey, don't be leaning all back on that, man. That's pretty calf skin leather, put up from Italy. Now look, tell me this shit again. Man, me and Chuck went to make the normal motherfucking pickup like we always do. Man, the shit was going down cool till some motherfuckers in mass started jumping down and shit. That How many shit. of them was it? How many of them was it? Man, I don't know. Three, maybe four motherfuckers? You need to start getting real specific, motherfucker. Man, there was three, man. One of them was a bitch. How the hell you know it was a bitch? Man, she talked, man. I heard the bitch voice. You think Lonzo set this shit up? No, man, this was somebody else. Lonzo wouldn't do no shit like this, man. Everybody got done in. Everybody. Except for you? What? Except for you, nigga. Man, I apologize for saving my own ass. You think I had something to do with this pack? 
Man, I caught a bullet in the arm because of this bullshit. Fuck that. Look, tell me my cheese and my dope ain't sitting at your house with a plane ticket to a wire. Tell me you ain't had shit to do with my shit getting taxed. Tell me that. Man, I ain't had shit to do with this, Pat. Four hundred thousand. You sure? I counted it twice. Uh -huh. Count that shit again. Man, I can count it fifty more times. It's gonna be four hundred thousand all goddamn day. Man, I ain't seen this much money in my whole motherfucking life. Man, Lexus told me it was probably fifty thousand. That bitch was off about three and a half. Wait a minute. We need to take a second. This might not be good. Man, what's up with this nigga? Since when this much money ain't been good? And plus. Look at this shit right here. Ooh, yes, sir. We've got powder. Look, losing 50000 is one thing. You think losing 400000 and some dope? You think a nigga ain't gonna try to come back and try to find out who took it? Don't nobody know what's us, though. Look, this nigga Big Pat, he gonna want his money back. And whoever supplies him his dope, they gonna want their dope back. So? Look, only thing I'm telling y'all, man, is that we need to lay low for a couple of weeks, and then we're gonna split the cheese up. And who holds it until then? I'm gonna hold it. Hell no, nah, nigga, hell no. Nah. Did I ask you? Did I ask you? Because if I had any ounce of sense, I'd left your dumb ass laying out there in the warehouse with the rest of them suckers. Nigga, what you say, boy? Bitch, don't get it twisted. Because if you want to act like a nigga, I'd knock your stank ass out just yeah, like a nigga. Fuck nigga, nigga man, 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 this shit, man. Let's just chop this motherfucking shit up, man. I got to go home, man. I'm telling you, P, man. All of us at risk getting this thing, man. Only thing I'm telling y'all, man, is if the money is in one place, it's easy to keep an eye on it. Why that motherfucking one place gotta be your place? That's what I can't understand. This nigga think he's smarter than all of us. Since cause we get our hands on a little cheese like we don't know what the fuck to do with it. Nigga, who to say you won't run out with the motherfucking money? Be laid up in Mexico some motherfucking word, nigga? Look, dawg. From Jump Street, I said we could do it your way. I stand my motherfucking word, you know what I'm saying? We trust this nigga this far, let's do it. What about the dope? Look. Y'all can keep that dope. I don't give a fuck about the rest of that bullshit. Yeah, but just think, just think what the street bank shit could bring us. Plus the 400,000, we pay. Look, use your head. What you gonna tell everybody that the dope fairy left us up under your pillow? Man, we can sell the shit out of town, man. Like Nashville and ATL or some shit. Ain't no weird in this, partner. Y'all can do what the fuck y'all wanna do with these drugs. Look, just wait till I get out of town. Whatever. Look, I'm gonna take everything and stash it in a couple of weeks. We gonna settle up then. Is that cool? Cool. Uh, yeah. What else? Mm, it's cool. It's cool. the motives of the grisly shootings which took place late last night at the Heritage Point Warehouse District are being rumored as drug related, authorities Roger. will not confirm. Come eat, baby. They have stated that Here I come. As of today, no suspects have been identified in connection to the crimes. For Channel 18 Newswatch, this is Janine Hodges. Hey man, this shit come wait until in the morning, man. Keisha not sleep. We feel like this situation ain't working, man. Man, I ain't been number two days. I thought we said we were gonna let the money sit. It's easy for you, sir. Man, I haven't touched that money. Nigga, what we saying is, I ain't no more motherfucking waiting, dog. Ain't like that we don't trust you. It seems like that's what I'm hearing. Shit, trust go both ways, nigga. DJ, you feel the same way. This shit ain't personal. That it ain't. All right, fuck it, man. Come on. Let me put some clothes on. Man, this is the best thing right here. Mm. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. <laughs> Look, we're gonna split the cheese now. But this dope gonna stay with me until I leave town, because I don't want y'all to do oh, nothing man. stupid. Cool, we gotta stay small on this. Use your head. 
You can't be going out buying nothing that's gonna draw attention. Like what? Yeah, nigga, like what? Buying a house or some shit? Okay, smart ass. I want you to follow your routine. I want you to do the same thing you do every day. If you drink Kool-Aid every day, keep drinking Kool-Aid. Don't go out and start buying Cristal. Don't nobody know we did this but us. Let's keep it like that. Man, you wear it too fucking much, man. From here on, we chilling, dog. Man, just give me my y'all's dog. That's what I'm talking about. Look, here go these raggedy ass guns, man. They got a screw, didn't it? Whatever. I'm keeping this one right here for me. Cool. Daddy. What's wrong, baby? I had a bad dream. Look, let's go ahead and go back to bed, and I'll be up there to tuck you in a little bit later. Man, you Look, don't do nothing stupid, stupid, man. Don't buy nothing. Man, don't we, buy nothing. No, we right, straight we from here, you, man. man. We got you. Man, we got you. We got you. Man, look, man. In a couple of weeks, man, I promise this should be all over with. A motherfucker right. won't be thinking about this shit. All right, all right. Shit. I'm all right. Okay. <laughs> Pat here to see you. Have you ever seen anything more beautiful than the sun setting on the Mississippi River? It's like a living piece of art. Talk to me, Pat. Okay, look, man, this thing been going straight for about a year now. Lonzo, I don't know what the business is. How can you explain this? Look, it's got to be somebody on the outside, somebody local. I don't know who. Look, Pat, this don't make the organization look good. You owe me two hundred and seventy thousand plus twenty-five thousand. I know. I don't like outstanding debts, Pat. Look, I got some of my people right now out shaking the bushes. Some gonna fall through, man. I just need a little time. When it comes to my money. Time and trust, those are two things I can't afford to invest into. I'm giving you 72 hours. That's a total of three days. Or else you're going to be held responsible for it, Pat. I can understand that, man. Hey, look, man. I need you to get on a situation for me. Quick, fast. Tomorrow, motherfucker, start dying. Start dying. Somebody know what went on and who did it. And some motherfucker better start talking soon. Don't play. If you think you know I'm straight, then you better think twice. Say you ain't got no cheese, then I'm Jekyll and Hyde. About to click on this bitch, cause she need to learn me. Beat her with my pistol, when I found she burned me. It's the first of the month, you can call me Sambo. I'm addicted, sold down, cause I like the gamble. In a purse, I ramble. On her head, I trample.
I'm out here trying to bring her home. Cause I hustle on the low. I ain't trying to go for gold. So bitch, don't call my trouble. If you do, I'ma cut your throat. Mix a game with some yak is a deadly potion. If I hit it from the back, bitch, I want the potion. In your pussy stroke, hold a pimp is spoken. DOA, if you try to play my emotions, I'ma crack a whole dome. I ain't broke a damn law, not a nigga. My phone, so I broke the bitch's jaw. You done quit your damn job, then you need to start hoeing. Boots and clothes, playing chase, cause a pimp ain't going. In the club, shaking ass, that can bring plenty cash. But you get more loot with a VIP pass. Say your ass got robbed when you should've given honey. Now you get the fuck up. What's up, dog? My man, do you have any gray poupon? Man, nigga ain't got nothing but that scissor up in that yak. Giggity yak, don't come back. How about some Don Perignon? <laughs> nigga might have that, dog. You know what I'm saying? I got a little bit, a little bit. Y'all boys clean, ain't the rat washed up in some more shit, man, ain't you know a nigga do it on the M-Town, baby. Shit, you clean your damn self, nigga. That's all right, though. I'm taking this job back in the morning, though. You know how we do that white, baby. Right, I got a flip in the morning. I don't white, I don't white. On 2020s. Y'all gonna be at the spot tonight? All right, got to. Yeah. You know we'll see y'all down there. All right, all right my man. Use a rubber. I'm so high, 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 I'm so Things will kill you, Stan. We all gotta go sometime. So I got a statement from one of the victims. First, he said that he was in the house to pick up his cousin. Couldn't remember his cousin's name, though. When I told him he was going down for possession, convinced him it'd be better for the DA if he cooperated. Well, what'd he give us? Says the guy who did this was Smooth Brown. Works for Big Pat Childs. We got ourselves a regular vendetta going on here. And all roads lead back to Childs. Well, we can't confirm for certain, but apparently the truck that was hit at the warehouse is part of Charles' operation. Well, obviously he ain't gonna stop until he gets him. Oh, look, there's no way I'm pulling AT tonight. Let's call it a day. You go on home. I have a few things I want to check on tonight. And let you make me look bad my first week on the job? <laughs> Sorry to bother you, boss. Now, I know you're a busy man, so I won't take up too much of your time. I'm detective. Look, look, say the introduction. I know y'all some cops. I can smell it on you. Yeah, all on. I got work to do. Is there a problem, Mr. Charles? I'm fine, man. I'm straight. I'm straight. I'm straight. So this is the kind of setup drug money buys these days. Oh, 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 oh. Detective. You know, y'all not the first people from law enforcement to harass me about my business. But just like I've said before, I'm legit, baby. You're a fucking liar. Stan, take it easy. Now, you may think you're a smart ass, but you're not. Just because my clothes cost more than a month of your paychecks? You better watch yourself. This town's going to get cleaned up, by the books or not. I don't take threats kindly. Take it any way you want. OK, I've been with y'all enough. Now, either you can be escorted out, or I'm going to call the captain and let him know about this little unannounced visit. You fucking cock We're sucker. sorry to have disturbed you. If we have any questions, we know where to find you. Yeah, I guess you do. What the hell was that? 
Hey, you want to get a read on somebody? You go straight to the source. I just wanted to look into his eyes, see what we're dealing with here. What'd you say? He ain't going down without a fight. Slop on my knob, like corn on the cob. Check in with me and do your job. Lay on the bed and give me head. Don't have to ask, don't have to beg. Juicy is my name, sex is my game. Let's cover boys, let's run a train. Squeeze on my nuts, lick on my butt. The natural curly hair, please don't touch. First find a mate, second find a place. Third find a bag to have the whole face. Real name Grover, I said been over. I started to knock, then came the odor. Smelt like mush, shouldn't have a whoosh. Told her to stop and take a dish. Once she did- Damn bitch, could you keep my shit flowing at my motherfucking table? Shit, I'm gonna get drunk up in this thing. You said talking. you would call. Man, later, man. Damn, some other time, uh, man. Fuck. We need to talk. I told your ass later. Damn. Right now. Hold up, hold up. Let right now. I think I'm pregnant. Pregnant? Yes, Juice. Pregnant. So why, why are you telling me? You the only man I've been dealing with in the last two months. I'm like I supposed to believe that shit, man. You can tell that shit to some other nigga. Look, bitch, I'll knock your motherfucking ass out. Son of a bitch! Let's see how bad you are when I tell Pat what you did. You think I'm stupid, don't you? I told you when you did it. I mean, who else would know about this shit? How'd you get this watch? Not sweeping office buildings. You better uh, keep your motherfucking mouth shut. Or what? You talk, you be the first motherfucker to die. It was because of you. I'm sorry, Pat. Oh, Pat, I'll make it up to you. I will make it up to you. You crazy as fuck. I'm out of here, man. Fuck you! Watch your feet, baby. What's up? Man, this your idea of laying low. What? Come on, man. So this the shit I was talking about, man. This motherfucker don't draw attention. You got a brand new excursion on twenties, man. Too cheaper than the Range Rover. We supposed to lay low, man. You got black. Come on, man. What is you doing? That's pretty nice, man. Man, if you get caught, man, niggas gonna start talking, man. Man, look. I got this, man. I thought about what you said, man. And it ain't every day a Black Haven nigga come up on a hundred G's, man. I had to have a little fun, man. Come on. Man, Jeez. if you get caught, man, don't say my motherfucking name, man. I promise, man. I'm straight, man. I got you. I ain't the one you need to worry about anyway. You bitch chat went to jail last night. I hope got caught with some blow. With possession and intent. Uh, with ten or whatever the fuck they call it. Y'all fucking up, man. Y'all fucking up, man. This was not what we planned, man. We just planned to lay low, man. No, I shouldn't have gave y'all this motherfucking money, man. When last time you talked to you? A couple of days ago. Yeah, all right. Man, take this truck and park it, man. Take this fucking truck and park it, man. All right, all right. Thanks. And tell your little girl I said what's up. And her mama. Especially her mama. Yeah. That bitch, that bitch got picked up last night, man. That bitch stole a key of dope. Damn. DJ brought a brand new excursion on 20s. I told you motherfuckers to lay low, man. Man, also that bitch blew up on me at the club last night. Who? The Lexus bitch. The fuck you doing at the club? Man, oh man, I was up in the house all day, man. Nigga a boy, man. Nigga had to get out, man. A lot of hoes at that motherfucker, man. What happened, man? Man, she threatened Pat, man. She threatened to tell it, man, man. Threatened? Yeah. Bitch was talking about she was pregnant and shit. I told her to give me some room, man, but... But the bitch for real was the bitch that's trying to bust the ball. I don't even know. What we gonna do? Look, man. I'm 
don't look. I'm gonna call you back, man. I need to think. All right, that's cool. What choice you get, man? You just an ace con to the motherfuckers. Because I don't like you. You walk around like the world owes you something. Five niggas are dead now. Five fucking niggas are dead now. First you would keep the little secrets from me. Bitch, you better kill me because your ass is dead. Maybe this isn't the right job for you. And before long, I didn't know what to believe when you opened your You know what stands between you and jail me. You have a daughter who's just getting to know Daddy. Me. Is everything okay, baby? Yeah, I just gotta get out. I got your message. Come on in, baby. Wanna have a drink or something? Mm, I'm fine. I heard you was a little upset last night. Everything all right? Last night? Ah, oh, that wasn't even worth talking about. Let me decide that. Now, so who are you talking with? Some guy I know, Patrick. Why you keep asking me so many questions? You know, baby, you should tell me everything. Why are you starting to act funny? That hurts me, baby. What's his name? His name is Juice, damn. Juice? Ain't that the motherfucker we kicked out the club the other night? Same motherfucking one. Now what this nigga talking to you about, baby, got you so upset? Now I ain't finna be asking you twice. Damn, I, I told him I was pregnant. Pregnant? You can't this nigga, baby? You need to watch who you be fucked. Patrick, please. Smooth. <laughs> what kind of beer this nigga went up the other night? Almost a motherfucking G note. A G? Ain't this a motherfucking janitor? Ain't this nigga sweeping floors or some shit? Word to know if Memphis says so. Now how the hell a fucking janitor? A janitor? Spinning up a G in the club wearing platinum and diamonds. Christmas came early? Pussy came early. <laughs> you know, I thought about who I might run my mouth off to? Who might know my affairs? And the only person I could think of is you. I'm sorry, baby. It was a mistake. You I... damn right it was a mistake. I can make it up to you. You can't make this shit up. Not this time. Take the glasses off. Right about now, cooperation is your only hope. Listen, I told you, the shit ain't mine. It ain't even my car. You know what, the DA doesn't give two shits whose car it is. Look, they're not playing games. Penalties for narcotics are stiff in this city. You need to make sure that people see that they're serious. So finding somebody like you is their dream come true. Proof they're doing their jobs. Look, possession with intent Distribute that carries 12 to 15 years in prison. Do you want to spend the next 12 years in prison? Fuck up your whole life. We're looking for something bigger, okay? But if you don't give us something, then we're gonna have to sell. It's obvious you got it over your head. Help us secure this conviction, and we can turn this into a slap on the wrist. Maybe even knock it down to a misdemeanor. Who supplied you? All right. I'll tell you what. Put it in right. Cut me a deal. And I'll tell you what you want to know. We will. You have my word. His name Poncho Davis. Terrence Davis, 26, convicted one count of murder in the second degree, an accomplice. Last known address? Nothing. He was paroled about three months ago. 
We'll check and see who his parole officer is. Right. Take care. I got your money, man. I just want you to know, whatever gone down between the two of us, nothing personal. Business personal? Don't even make a difference. Okay. Came here to make a proposition with you. Yes, sir. Five thousand dollars. That's what I'm willing to pay you if I never see or hear from you again. You want me to give this up? Ain't no room for negotiation on this here, right? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Let's just cool down, bro. Whoa. Yeah. Okay, okay. Look, this how it's going down. Look, just fill out the papers and grant me permission to leave and go out of town. That's it. Look, I never meant for any of this Look, to go just shut the fuck up and fill the fucking papers hey, out. Hey, 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 hey. Look, let me help you out here, partner. Hey, Bitch, now you playing hey, my motherfucking hey, hey, papers. Hey, hey, hey. Sign the All motherfucking right. papers. Motherfucking straight, man. If I have to come back in here, you're gonna go meet your motherfucking mate. Motherfucker, you. Get him up! Get him up, Terry! Get him up! Don't fucking... Put your hands on the hood! Spread your legs, boy! Uh, come on! Don't you fucking move! Oh, what do we have here? Say good, Terry. Certified garden variety parole violation. Another one. Damn, Terrence, this ain't good. I want my fucking phone call. Come on, let's go. My fucking phone call, man. Because we're not in the mood to talk right now. That's okay. Come on, let's go. Get in there. Come on, come on, boy. Let's go. You got five minutes, homeboy. Tisha, I need you to listen to me. I need you to go in the hall closet and get the brown paper bag off the top shelf. What are you talking about? Tisha, I don't have no time to explain. I need you to just go and get the bag out the closet off the top shelf. Baby, what's wrong? You're scaring me. Oh my God, Terrence! Terrence, what's happening? Talk to me. You're you're in trouble. He said, "I did this for us, man. I did this for us." Baby, you're in you're in trouble. Baby, tell me what's happening. Look, I'm sorry. I I know I said I wouldn't fuck up, but I fucked up. I am really sorry. I fucked up. Baby, just talk to me. Look, do you remember what we said we were going to go someday? Florida? Yeah. I just want you and Tiana to just pack what you can and just get the fuck up out of there. Somebody's on their way over there now. Just get the fuck out of there. Baby, where are you? Look, just get what you can get and go, and I promise I'll meet you there. Just tell me that you'll do it. All right. Baby, I love you. Time's up. Yo, bitch, I think you got some on. Uh... I thought I told you I had to call for you. Surprise. Ah! Surprise, surprise. Fuck this shit. Ah! 
I don't know what she told you, but that shit all lies. Look, I don't got time for this shit. This shit is simple. All Pat wants is his dope and his motherfucking money. You cooperate, and we'll keep an open mind about this shit. What the fuck y'all want? Where's the money? It's in the kitchen. Well, come on, nigga. Get your shit. ass up. Ah. Shut up. is real cute. Come on, motherfucker. Cute. Real fucking cute. Trip me again, bitch. I'm gonna kill you. Fuck you! Shut up, bitch! <laughs> you wanna die? How much is left? I think about 75000 You think? Where's the coat? Oh, no! Ah! Do it look like I'm fucking around here? Chat took that shit. Police picked that ass up, man. I'm bleeding here. Bleeding? I got shot in the arm because of you motherfuckers. Shot? That really fucked my week up. I got something put in your mouth, bitch. What the fuck is this shit? Shut up, nigga. This is for Big Pat. That shit was too easy. Man, we got our shit back, then. <laughs> on the real, dog. You think Pat'll let me keep this ride? Man, just follow me. Keep both hands on the wheel and make sure the 5 0 don't pull us over. Man. Y'all plan on keeping me here all night? You're safer with us than out on the street. The drugs you have turns you into a mocked man, Poncho. I don't deal in no motherfucking drugs. Sharice Taylor. I believe you know her as Chap. She fingered you. That bitch lying. DNA is an amazing thing, Poncho. I could take a hair from that mask, match it to one on your head, and it would hold up in court. Can you believe that? Two of your friends were found murdered earlier this evening. How long before you're next? The drugs in your possession have put your life in jeopardy. Now use your head, Poncho. And we can put an end to all this. Can we make a deal with the gun charges if I, if I take you to the dope to, to clear my parole? Now you see how easy things can be when you cooperate. You wait here. Let's go, Poncho. Come on. Man, that's it, man. The rest of that chat bitch, man. You helped yourself more than you realize, Pancho. Get going. We're all set.
Stan, hold on, you just missed our turn. Relax, relax. Where the fuck you two bitches taking me? Keep your mouth shut back there, boy. doing out here? Get out! Man, I ain't going no motherfucking work. Get out! Hey, Stan, stop fooling around, man. Get back in the car and let's go to squat. Sorry, buddy, can't do that. Stan, put the gun down! I don't know why you're doing this, but I can't let you. What do you want me to tell you? It don't make no difference if he lives or dies. Fact is, as soon as we take care of him, there'll be someone along to take his place. We're supposed to be the good guys. It's not going down like this. Think about what you're doing and put the gun down. Wanting to do this for a long time. Unit 36, Unit 36. Have an officer down at the Kinley Auto Yard. Request for immediate ambulance. Over. I'm here on the scene of one of the most remarkable criminal developments in recent memory. In one dramatic standoff, we've seen this city's month-long string of vicious drug slayings come to a brutal and unfortunate end. Terrence Pancho Davis, 26, convicted of murder and recently paroled, seemed to go on an unrelenting barrage of mayhem and revenge upon his release. All told, nine dead victims left in his wake. Among them, police detective Brian Wilcox, killed in the line of duty. Through the bravery of Detective Stanley Mesmer, this man was finally brought to justice, risking his own life and the life of his own partner, who sadly, he could not save. Detective Mesmer's bravery does not go unnoticed. We will continue with ongoing coverage of this story as details are released. For Channel 18 Newswatch, this is Janine Hodges. I think we're both gonna retire rich and happy someday soon. Yeah, as long as we keep running our shit like this. You think they went for it? I'll get back to you after the parade of my honor. <laughs> Mesmer, you know you've been my dog since day one. What'd I do without you? Well, here's to hoping we never have to find out. And that's for real. <laughs>
all aboard the train. Those who kept it real couldn't hang. I'm a holler main. This one you feel. Well, I feel choices I made. Ways to get paid. If I lay down on my back, then I won't get jacked. Project Pat never fit the deal. All about a meal. Keep a strap for the wolf pack. Out here trying to steal. Cause I still think some of y'all wanna see me fall. But I ball. That's in any weather. Can we stick together? All this one. But I know this some always wanna preach that I'm wrong. Cause I rap a song. Lyrically, I reach to the youth. And I'm getting and I'm at the slums, legally, ghetto fabulous, player give me some kind of props, cause I never stop, trying to get laid, feeling good, stacking dollar bills, choices I made. Ain't no pain, just a lot of love, courage, do your thing. Good choice. 